Hi, and welcome to Skelly's Farm Market Up Close, Cooking Edition. Today, we're in the kitchen with our sweet corn. And I gotta say, sweet corn is probably one of the best things about summertime. So today, we're gonna look at some of the easy ways to prepare it, whether you wanna grill it, boil it, or cook it in the microwave. Now, certainly there are a few other methods, but these are the most common and some of the easiest ways to cook sweet corn. So let's get started. Now, first off, for grilling corn, we want to make sure that we still have the husk on it as opposed to our other two methods. So we've selected good corn that has a nice husk, still nice and closed up at the top here um, to make sure that when it soaks and grills, it doesn't get too burned up towards the top. So we're making sure it's nice and um, closed. And we're going to take and just put it in some cold water and we're going to let it soak. And we're going to let the corn soak in this water for around um, half an hour to an hour at least because we want to get a lot of uh, moisture into the husk so it doesn't burn and just get a little water barrier in between that husk and the corn kernels themselves. So while we let that soak for a while, let's take a look at the other things. We also have our boiling method and the microwave method. With this, we've already gone, we've cleaned or taken all the husk off um, and discarded that. We've washed the corn to get um, the silk and just make the corn nice and clean with that. Now we have some water boiling over here on the stove and we're going to let that continue to boil for a while. And while we're doing that, let's take a look at the microwave method. Now the microwave method, you can use two types of dishes. You can either use a dish that you put in the microwave and we can put our husk and wash corn right in that. Take, we can add a little bit of water in the dish just to keep a little bit extra moisture in there. And we cover it. From there, we could go and put it straight in the microwave. Now one other idea we have is if, the great thing about the microwave is that if you only have one um, ear of corn or just a couple ears of corn, you don't even need to dirty a dish. So we'll just go and grab some wax paper here, rip off a nice piece, and take and wrap that corn in the wax paper. We're gonna take and just twist tight on the ends and to seal in that ear of corn. Now when we wash it before, that helped add a little bit of moisture and because it's more of a closed uh, container here than the dish, it's going to work fine going into the microwave. So at this point, we're going to take it over to the microwave. We're going to cook the corn for a minute and a half to two minutes per ear. Uh, if you're doing one ear, it's going to be closer to that two minutes. If you're doing multiple ears, it's going to be closer to that minute and a half per ear. So we're going to put that in the microwave and let it cook. And our corn is all done. We're going to take it out of the microwave using some tongs because it's very hot at this point. We're going to place it on a plate and it's all ready to eat. Now we can leave this wrapped up for a few more minutes which will keep the heat in there uh, while we're finishing up the rest of our meal. Now that we've looked at how to cook the corn in the microwave, let's take a look at the boiling method. We've brought our water over to a boil here, so we're going to take and add our ears of corn. Now we're not going to add any salt to the water because that'll end up making it more tough than it needs to be. So we're going to put our lid back on, let it boil, bring the water back up to a boil, and let it boil for about five to 10 minutes, depending on how much you like your corn cooked. Now our corn's been cooking for about seven or eight minutes now, so we're gonna take it on out of the water because I like my corn about medium done. We'll take tongs, be real careful because it's gonna be really steamy and hot, and oh, that looks really good right now. So our boiling method is all set. Now let's take a look at the grilling method. We have been letting that corn soak for half an hour to an hour or so now. So we're gonna be able to take this corn out and let's head on out to the grill. Now we threw the corn on the grill about 15 minutes ago. Typically corn takes about 10 to 15 minutes to grill, depending on whether you're using a gas or charcoal grill and just how fast and hot your grill might cook. So we've rotated it a few times and it's starting to get brown. So let's take a look at what it looks like down here. You can see the outside of the husk is starting to get a nice brownish black color to it. Still being green, not overly cooked, but well done. Seeing how this looks, I think it's about ready to take it inside and eat some tasty grilled corn. Well, as you've seen here, we've found three different ways to cook our corn. We, we've tried our boiling method, our grilling method, and our microwave method. Now we just need to get them ready to eat. Well, obviously the, grilling, or the boiling method is already set to go. We just gotta go and put it on the plate. Our microwave method, we've let it cool just a few minutes now. So we're gonna unwrap our wax paper. It's still pretty hot, so be careful there. And that ear of corn's ready to eat also. Finally, we got our grilling method. Now you can see we got our corn that's nice and hot. The husk is brown, and we're gonna need to peel that back. 
We're going to pull back the outside there. And it peels really easy once it's warm like this. And you can just feel the heat coming off of that with the moisture that was in there and the grilling effect. Now this one, if we would have left it on there a little longer, we might have even had some brown kernels. Uh, with this, we kept it as more of a light cooking and it cooked real nicely that way. Still real warm and ready to eat. That's the three main ways that we like to cook our corn. Now the task for you is to try all three and see which one is your favorite to cook your skelly corn. Enjoy!